Okay, quick update. Uh, we are locked out of Sherwood for the moment, uh, just waiting on the OWS to be approved by Environmental Health. They wouldn't allow us to move forward with our uh, three bedrooms proposed when it was existing a two bedroom, even though they promised at the beginning. So we had to revise it, put it back to a one bedroom to make it really easy. Uh, all the walls are there, we just removed two doors. Uh, but here's some pictures for you. Uh, let's see here. Okay, so as you can see here, uh, they're on the exterior of the garage. We painted those doors brown, green, so we have nice color contrast. We had heat tents all the way around. You can see they literally tended the whole garage and the entire house. Uh, so you can see they did a great job tenting, working in a nice controlled environment. Um, so here's your work here. Doing a great job, sides of the house, sides of the garage there, uh, side of the garage there. So the exterior is all wrapped up. This is uh, the new rec room that was one of the bedrooms. We had to change it to a rec room. Uh, as you can see here, all the um, insulation uh, has been doubled up and the sheetrock is in. Uh, a lot of patchwork that was a huge part of the process due to you know numerous additions throughout the years. It was just kind of buttoned up together, so we had to go back in, we literally leveled the floors, sistered the floor joists to give it some structural integrity, and then of course uh, finished with uh, sheetrock. Now, as you can see here, here's the hatch room, this is the other bedroom. Uh, this is the master bedroom. This is the entry with a custom built door that'll be a maroon with a nice big side light there. Uh, this is the dining room, as you can see they wrapped the beams uh, the beams will have a contrasting uh, chocolate color. Uh, this is the, a new beam we put in on that new window by the entry of the mudroom. This was all wrapped out. This is the common bath. Uh, here's the kitchen. Uh, existing fireplace, we're going to end up doing this in uh, oil rub bronze. And then the back here is all dry stack uh, stone, which will have a nice look. And then he's going to put a glass uh, band through here, our mason Matt Biffle, um, to give it a, a ambient backlit glow. Now here's another shot. You can see this is when they were wrapping the, the beams to give all the beams a nice wrapped and clean look. Here's another shot looking back into the kitchen. Shot at the front door. Here's the rear of the property. So we have multiple color stain. You only have uh, one green area around the master bedroom. All the rest is this wrap stain. So what's going on really turned out beautiful. It has a really nice look to it. And then chinking will go into a couple of the areas to seal. Uh, and then that'll be a maroon front door and side light. There you can see the stain and the chocolate. All the, this is when they were going through and did the fascia. Of course the fascia and the soffit all gray, petrified wood. And there's another shot of that same Shot. So that's it. That's your update. Uh, we hope to have plans um, revised uh, and accepted here on Monday or Tuesday, February 12th or 13th.